Hi everybody, it's Heidi. I uh, just wanted to do a quick project share with you guys. Um, this is a gift that I made for a friend of mine. Um, her and her significant other moved into a new home, so we're going to visit them this weekend. And I wanted to make them a little housewarming gift, so this is what I came up with. Um, it's long, so uh, as you can see, it's long. So I can't get the whole thing in frame because I'm on an iPad and I don't know how to zoom in or even if I can. Uh, so I'll just show you piece by piece. Um, so the, the back backing is chipboard. Uh, I used the Prima Divine paper. I sprayed each of the little each of the pieces of paper a little bit so with some Lindy so that it would have a little bit of shimmer. I didn't want it to be crazy shimmery. Uh, is I didn't want it to be too girly girly. Uh, I don't know if it's still girly girly. I don't think it is. Uh, their home is uh, it's a beautiful home. They have it's kind of rustic and and brown colors and so I thought this would fit in nicely. Um, so anyways, chipboard uh, with the Prima Divine paper. These obviously just pieces of wood. So uh, the K and the M, Kim and Mark. And I just gessoed these and I sprayed them with uh, Lindy's as well as some Glimmer Mists and uh, just got that kind of to a nice shine and it's sort of, you know, it is kind of rust, rustic looking, somewhat imperfect. Um, so they came out really good. I was really happy with that. These, This is a uh, butterfly punch that I have that makes all three, it punches all three of these little butterflies so that it will get that 3D effect. Uh, these pieces of metal that I have here that live live love laugh they are momenta metal and I got those at Joann's uh, the fibers that are behind these two are actually that's yarn that's actually some yarn uh, needed a little something I kept I had it all done I had these things sitting on these two letters and they just look like they need a little help so I summoned my sis sister via text just like some fibers or something so uh, yarn that worked. Looks good. I like the way they came out. Um, Wild Orchid Craft Flowers here. I just got a little tiny swirly do there. Uh, these hearts are Heidi Swap. They're the ones that you can uh, spray and wipe. But I will tell you, these are so some of these ones are so small, and I think it's because I actually have some more of them sitting right here. Um, they're really pretty. I really like them, but I think it's because it's such a small little area that's taking the color that I ended up having to use my dabber and then wiping it off because the, the sprays just kind of puddled on them. Um, when I wiped it off, it just wiped everything off. It didn't really leave any color behind, so um, I need to use my inker, which is fine. They, they came out really nice. Uh, this is a beautiful flower that my mother, flat little flower doily my mother crocheted. So I, that was white and I sprayed that with some Oh, what was it? Oh, Perfect Pearls. And little glossy accents here on this bird. Uh, and the M, pretty much the same deal. Got the butterfly there, and he's got the um, piece of metal as well. Strung it together with a piece of uh, ribbon. And the back is like this. And I actually, I did end up gluing these down because when if I didn't, when I was holding it up, they were kind of sticking out the side. So I glued those down. That's just my name. And that is pretty much it. Pretty simple. Really fun to do. Actually, when I got this all done and held it up to the wall, I thought, jeepers, maybe I make one of these for myself and my husband. I, I've, uh, I haven't made anything for myself, so maybe this would be a nice, uh, you know, to me from me. Um, so anyways, yeah, that's it. Pretty much that's the gist of it. Um, I hope you guys like it. I hope she likes it. And I hope you're all having a great night. Take care. Bye.